Hi, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing, and this is the HP Touchpad tablet, which is running Google Android. This is uh, currently running Signage and Mod 7 Alpha 3, and I'm going to upgrade it to Alpha 3.5, which was just released. And if you've already installed Signage and Mod uh, 7, an earlier version, it's extraordinarily easy to update. You can also update from scratch, uh, going from a WebOS operating system, but that takes a little bit more work, and you can find details at lilliputing.com. Here's how to do it if you already have Signage and Mod installed. You just go to the uh, Roots Wiki forum, look for the HP Touchpad forum, and find the uh, subforum for Android, and then the one that says Signage and Mod, and there should be a post at the top that says Release Alpha 3.5. You should definitely make sure to read all the instructions, but we're going to skim them because I've already done that. And you scroll down until you get to some links towards the bottom, and you want to download the link for Alpha 3.5. And there it is. So in this case, that would take us to the download page. I've already downloaded it, and it's stored on my internal storage. So we're going to go to the next step, which is to reboot the device into recovery mode. And so here we have Clockwork Mod Recovery. You can go through here and wipe the cache partition and do a factory reset if you want to. Um, wipe your data partition, but I'm just going to go ahead and wipe the cache partition for now. And so you're using the volume keys to navigate and the home button to select yes. Okay, so cache is wiped. Now I'm going to install zip from SD card. Choose zip from SD card. And since it's not in my primary directory, I need to scroll until I find the download directory. I remember if it's download or downloads, it is download. So I'm going to select update CM 7.1 Tenderloin A 3.5 full of bugs, which is an indication that it still doesn't necessarily have everything working properly. Use the volume to scroll until I hit yes, and here we go. Now this might take a couple of minutes, and then rebooting might take a few minutes as well. Um, Alpha 3.5 is supposed to offer improvements in video playback, uh, 3D graphics speed, and 3D gaming performance. They've also made some changes to wireless, which um, may or may not actually help. Some people have been uh, complaining that they've had problems with wireless working properly. And um, that's pretty much it, I believe. So. For the most part, we're just looking for slightly better, more consistent performance here. No major new features. And now that we're done, we can go back and reboot system. We want to boot Cyanogen and Mod. Now this boot might be a little bit faster, or a little bit slower than a typical boot. Normally Cyanogen and Mod loads actually very quickly, faster than WebOS boots. But um, after installing a new update zip, it usually takes a little longer. And because we didn't do a factory reset, it should actually save all of our files and settings. If you're worried about losing data, or if you're worried about um, not liking the new version of the software, you can also use Clockwork Mod Recovery to make a complete backup of your system. And then if anything goes wrong, you can just reboot into Clockwork Mod again and do a restore from your backup. So, for instance, I actually flashed um, the MIUI uh, ROM on here the other day, which is a different version of Android, which has a completely different look and feel than Cyanogen Mod. And then I decided to go back to Cyanogen Mod, and all I had to do was restore from a backup that I had made.
Clearly this is the most fascinating part of the video. Uh, if you didn't catch all the steps that I mentioned in terms of scrolling down, scrolling up, clicking, uh, and so forth, don't worry, I'm going to have those listed on a blog post at lilliputing.com, and you can find the link to that in the uh, description of this video on YouTube. And so here we are. We've got the desktop. You can see that my applications are all still there. Wireless is already connected. 